Hey everybody, welcome to my living room carpet. This is going to be a quick review of this full motion TV wall mount. This is by, I think, Pippa Shell. It costs around $19.99. That's as, to, as of December 2021. The model number is PISF1. We're going to see what's involved with this. It's basically made for lighter TVs. Our application is going to be a 32-inch TV above the treadmill. This will hold from 13 up to 42 inches, and I think it's a 44-pound weight. This TV up here that we're going to use is probably around 10 pounds max, so well within the capabilities. Let's do a quick unboxing. All right, everybody, this is what is in the uh, actual box. It comes with the expandable arm, and this rotates 360 degrees, so if you want to watch something in portrait or landscape, you have that capability. This is the mount that's going to go on the back of your TV, this little square. And they've got a couple different, or these are the arms that will slide back and forth to match the holes on your particular flat screen you're going to mount. This is the little hook that will mount to the actual end of the arm itself. Let's see if I can do it here on the camera. Well, these screws will go in here so it's not just hanging, but it's mounted. It looks like it pushes it out a good reasonable distance. I'm guessing that's about 13 to 15 inches away. And then to articulate, oh, it's kind of stiff right now, and you don't want it to be too loose. Uh, it goes back and forth, and this should rotate on its end to get that portrait landscape capability. Uh, this is the part that you would mount to the wall, just two large um, uh, holes and the bottom one is elongated so you can obviously slide it left or right so you make sure it lies level. The mounting hardware they give you is good for it looks like a variety of walls. We're going to mount ours to a, a thick three-quarter inch wood paneling so we can just use deadbolt or the uh, carriage bolt type things or lag, lag bolt. We don't need the nylon anchors and then a variety of spacers and different screws of course to match the existing receptacle screw holes on the back of your TV. So for the deal of $19.99, you get a capable piece of equipment. I did not see the uh, specifications in the instruction manual here, so I looked them up online. This actually extends 14 and a half inches out from the wall and it will, uh, flatten out all the way to like 2.2 inches. So basically let your TV be flat against the wall. And the weight rating on this is 44 pounds. So it's significantly significantly capable uh, to even hold your older, heavier TVs. Modern TVs from a 13 inch up to a 42 inch are not gonna weigh anywhere near 44 pounds. They'll be about a half that maximum. So I'm gonna install this. This is the Pippa Shell TV wall mount. And uh, we are going to do a review afterwards. So we'll fade to black here and I'll come back up and show you what it looks like. The goal is to have this rigidly attached. The last little bit is pretty simple. Uh, this is currently upside down, but I just have it this way so I can drill the other hole. Uh, they have cleverly thought of how to install it smartest. The bottom hole is elongated, so you can slide it back and forth like that. So with a level, you can get this thing truly upright, truly 90 degree. And I'm just gonna drill the other hole in there and uh, then we'll do the mount. So two drills, oh, they give you some pretty serious lag bolts. These look like about two and a half inches long. And they're to go into a stud, and they also provide some masonry uh, anchors if you choose to mount it in masonry. Installation is complete, and this is the final review of the operational piece of this Pippa Shell TV mount. For $20, it's very capable. Um, it does get this 32 inch TV far enough out from the wall where it can be angled for the entire room, but really, we just want it over the treadmill or maybe there towards the uh, the hot tub, but uh, the sound is good, easy to mount, two lag bolts, 
and it came with enough hardware and enough different adapters that this would fit probably 90% of the TV backs out there, probably more than that. The only thing I could think of that would have been an improvement would be a little bit of a cord guide or channel guide. So I will just do some uh, zip ties on that, but I'm really pleased with the purchase. And if you want to learn more about it, <clears throat> excuse me, I'll send a link or I'll put a link down in the description where you can go check out Pippa Shell yourself or maybe even buy one if you'd like. $20 and you have a TV exactly where you want it securely. Thanks for watching. Wow.